Let's draw the structural formula for 1-butanol. In 1-butanol, we can also write it like this, C4H9OH. This is the chemical formula, call it the molecular formula. And this OH on the end, that's important. But we're interested in the structural formula for 1-butanol. So when we look at the name 1-butanol, we see this OL here at the end. This OL means we have an alcohol. We're going to have an OH bonded to a carbon. That's why we have the OH here by itself, because this OH is bonded to one of the carbons. So we have 1-butanol, it's an alcohol, and but right here, this tells us that we have a chain of four carbons. That's the longest chain. So we have four carbons, and there's going to be an OH group on one of those carbons. It's going to be on the first one, because it's 1-butanol. Let's look at that. So right now we just have butane. This is all single bonded carbons. These lines here, they all represent hydrogen atoms. Let's number this chain. So that's four, that's the but part. So now we need to add the alcohol substituent group, that OH right here on the first carbon. And that makes this the formula for one butanol. We have our four carbon chain, and then we have the alcohol on the first carbon here. Note that there would be a two butanol as well, we could just move this over here. That would be 2-butanol. But we don't have a 3-butanol because if we move the alcohol over here, then we'd want to renumber this from 1, 2, 3, 4. So that would just be 2-butanol. Either way, this right here is the formula for 1-butanol. The chemical formula, C4H9OH, the structural formula are four carbons with the OH group on the first carbon. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.